morning, Juniper Christian School students, teachers, and staff members. This is Christine Park speaking as a candidate for Associated Student Body Public Relations Manager. I'm currently in my sophomore year of high school and I'm running for PRM in the following year. The role of PRM is to promote ASB events, create and manage all materials for upcoming activities, and be a good example to students. I believe that I'm the most qualified candidate for this position because I have the different level of creative skills to, de to design posters, as you can see in my news concept poster, and give ideas for ASB events and have social skills as well as, fr as well as friendly and positive mindset to all people. I've always wanted to be the part of ASB because helping, serving, and caring has always been my job as a Christian, and I wanted to improve and develop these jobs by becoming a part of ASB. One of the reasons why I was determined to run for PRM specifically is to serve JCS students with my talents. I was told by my friends and teachers that I have creativity in designing, and now this is the time to show it to you. Although I do not have past experiences of being PRM, I have definite goals and plans for PRM if elected. My goal for working as a PRM this year is to share and inform you all the best possible information for ASB events and to discuss multiple ideas that the members of ASB have prepared for activities. There are some of the important terms I want to point it out, which are communication and interactions. There were times when I had questions and concerns for ASB events, but I could not go up and talk to the members about it. Even though there wouldn't be one if I get elected, I will receive all the criticism and comments and will strongly reflect it on future events. Also, I absolutely love interacting with people and as a person who is open to volunteer things that even others avoid, these characteristics already show that I will be a good ASB member. The goal when I get elected as an ASB member would be knowing and reflecting on the things that our JC students would like. Being, the, being in this school from the start of ASB, I have, been, I have been seeing various styles of PRM and their jobs. It was a good build-up to learn and prepare for today as a candidate for PRM, and that is another reason why I am a trustable candidate for PRM, who you should vote for. To wrap up my speech, I want to indicate my passion and desire to become PRM and as a member of ASB. I guarantee that you will have the best and the best and happiest time of school during ASB events, and we'll see the cool posters on our campus. Remember to check Christine Park on your ASB election paper. I will never let you down. Vote for hope and fight for what's right. God bless you and thank you. Good morning, JCS students, teachers, and staff members. I am Jenny Kim for 10th, from 10th grade, running for Public Relations Manager, also known as PRM, for this 2023-2024 academic year. Uh, this is my first time to publicly speak in chapel or any other places in JCS. So it's kind of nervous and it took me a long time thinking about what I should write in the speech. So I decided to share my story. When I was 10, I did not want to go to the academy. And one of the academies that I really not want to go was ironically the piano academy. The reason was that um, first of all, practicing and taking a lesson was really hard and boring. Every musical instrument, as you guys will know if you have played one, um, has no shortcuts learning it and it clearly shows my limitations so I did not want to show it to anybody or want to see my limitations so I did not like to go to the academy. And since my school's, school finished at 5.30, I was the last student to be in the academy so it was boring and it was not fun. But but I did not give up and challenged myself by playing various songs. So as a result, I overcame and won the third place in the piano academy, uh, piano contest in the age of 10. So this attitude is what I want to, what I will do if I become your public relations manager. I will challenge my limitations and use my creativity to make cool posters and creative posters and I will keep on improving during this year. And my final goal for being PRM is to communicate with every grade and I want to make poster so that everyone can enjoy and understand. So don't forget, a vote from you is hope for JCS. I'll vote for Jenny Kim and thank you. 
Hello everyone, my name is Grace Cho and I am, the ninth, I am in the ninth grade and I am currently running to be your Public Relations Manager or PRM. Uh, I am a freshman so I don't yet have experience in being part of the AASB, but I'm sure that I am the right fit, um, right fit to be your PRM as I have experience in designing things and I enjoy and I'm skilled in arts and crafts. A good PRM organizes and creates creative, well-informing posters for all the ASB events so students can see. They also communicate well with the student body and the teachers. And as part of ASB, they are committed to being a good role model for all the students. I believe that I will be able to fulfill the role of being a good and outstanding PRM, and I will work hard to serve all the students, the teachers, and the staff of JCS. The main purpose behind running as PRM is so that I can interact with the students and entertain them with the posters I design as well as serving everyone and working hard for you guys. And if I get elected as public relations manager, I intend to use my skills and talents to make future posters more bright, fun, and exciting to look at. I promise to bring into the ASB a new, fresh, fun, creative new perspective and so be bright and vote for who's right. Thank you. Good morning, JCS. This is Julie Choi from 11th grade running for secretary in the 2023 to 2024 academic year. It is an honor to stand here again as a candidate of secretary this year. I hope you guys are going to vote for me, but for those of you who are still unsure, I'll tell you why it should be me for the next secretary. I've been here at JCS for the last nine years and experienced many kinds of leadership here at JCS. I was a musical TA, one of the leaders in the mission trip, and have experienced both co-chair and chair for the Student Leadership Club Greenpeace. Through these experiences, I learned how to be organized, detailed, responsible, and humble. Those qualities made me the best candidate for secretary and will make me the best secretary for JCS. With my experiences and passion, I believe I'm the most fit secretary for JCS. If I become a secretary, there's one thing I want to show off. It is the attitude of sincerely loving our school and friends. The one and only reason why I, want, why I am running for secretary is because I want you guys to have more fun, exciting, and fruitful school life. Previous ASB members have led various events in our school but if I become a secretary, I would like to put those events together by listening to your thoughts and opinions. I'm also willing to bring up creative ideas that will make your school life enjoyable. I believe one person cannot change school. However, if we work together, we will be able to grow up as a better person and a better school. If I become a secretary, I guarantee that you will be able to make, see the changes that we made. Moreover, I'm confident that I can be a good communicator, listen to your voices, and be organized and detailed better than anyone else. Now, I hope you guys are confident and certain that I am the right choice for your guys' next secretary. So vote Julie Choi, and I'm looking forward to serving you guys as your next secretary. Thank you. There are multiple ways someone can view the ASB position. I view it as an opportunity that turns into account a student's toned qualities, but more so as a chance for students to develop and practice the skill of leadership. Hi there, I'm Kaylin Yu from the ninth grade, standing as a contender for the ASB's officer secretary role. Now, there are specific reasons why I'm choosing first to be become an ASB member in general and then why I'm choosing to be the role of a secretary. So to start off with a little backstory, when I was first attending the school about two years ago, while I was still fresh from the US, uh, uh, I saw the school and I was pretty uncertain about it and I wasn't very fond of it at first. <coughs> Not because I didn't like, like it, but because I didn't get to know it enough and wasn't 
used to it. So in the present, I definitely feel that I have. I definitely feel that I have different pers a different perspective about the school and because of what the school has done for me. And this gave me another question to think about, which is, what have I done for JCS? It was the question I was put up with. Even I was shocked at the amount of loyalty I had developed for the school. ASB seems like an opportunity for, and as a response to my question. To explain the role I am running for, the secretary, uh, secretary mainly keeps the records of all sorts of information for the ASB. Even before I showed up to JCS, while I was still in the US, my dream was to write and edit when I grew up. So it would mean a lot to me if I was voted and I got to serve you as, and write as a secretary and do what I like. So I brought five characters, six of mine, that most people would describe me as. Uh, they're both positive and negative. So I am dynamic, clever, truthful, and I'm also, pro I'm also pretty arrogant and disagreeable at times. Uh, there are some traits I'm proud of, like my cleverness and my ability to interact and take charge. But there's also some traits that I could work on. And they're, yeah, they're my, oh, they're not my best traits. But then I want to remind you again, like I said before, that even if I can be arrogant and disagreeable because I only think about myself sometimes, uh, I want to show you that everyone has room for improvement and if you guys vote for me, I want to show you that I can improve and grow in character as your leader. Even when you don't reach out, as the youngest high school grade, I'll search out for even the youngest voices and find the greatest alternate solutions for, for your opinions that may not be possible. If I am elected as your secretary, I can assure no mistakes, and there will be no, there will be no mistakes in ASB written affairs and work as efficiently and neatly as possible. I am attending not only to try my best, but to make it the best. Thank you for listening. May the best contender win. Good morning, JCS. I have a question for you. Do you want a slide in JCS? As I have your attention, I'll, let me introduce myself. My name is Daniel Kwok, also known as DK from ninth grade, and I'm running for treasurer this year. I've been in this school for seven years, and I've grown and matured with this school. Although I've never officially joined ASB, I have helped them bake fresh cookies for fundraisers in the past, as my sister was part of the ASP. I learned the positive effects that ASP gives to students through that experience. <clears throat> Every candidate here is perfectly qualified for their position, but what matters more is what I can offer you. If you offer me as treasurer, you're essentially trusting me. To return that trust, I will promise you three things. I will be helpful, I will be humble, and I will be hidden. After I did my MBTI test, I found that I am a team, uh, which means I make decisions that are best based on pros and cons rather than uh, emotionally driven. Uh, this means I can make de decisions that are best for a school and you. However, this does not mean that I will make all my decisions by myself. I cannot actually. It is self-evident that sharing is your voice is caring about your voice. Uh, I will be asking you what you want to from the school to be changed, and uh, from general in ASB activities to having longer wait time because your voice matters, and I'll make sure your voice is heard. Even though the former ASB promised to be more open to our suggestions as a student, it didn't feel as if our suggestions, suggestions were changing our school. 
I want to make a difference that will possibly affect our school. Um, we are a JCS family and we rise and fall as one family. Again, my name is Daniel Kwok, and also an SDK, and I'm running for treasurer. Thank you. Also, dollars makes sense to me. Thank you. All right. Greetings, fellow students, candidates, teachers, and staff members. My name is James Cho, who is currently attending here at Juniper Christian School as 10th grader, and also who is standing as your new treasurer. Now, treasurer is mainly responsible for managing mm, financial savings and spendings of mon money given on JCS. And I also found that what that managing finances involves mainly two things, mathematical skills and making right decisions in terms of making reasonable spendings or savings. And those findings also reminded me of my past experiences. Although I never have been standing as an ASB candidate before, but I have been pretty fond to math with joining mathematics math competitions like AMCs and Purple Cup as Math Me and getting, getting constant A's in grades, especially for math, and eventually growing myself as a math guy, although Mr. Lee had once said there's no such thing as math person. <laughs> uh, and with that findings and experiences, I would like to achieve mainly three goals. First is to boost efficiency in, ma in managing the, mo the money given on JCS, and second is to help, help ASB members to plan uh, fundraisers and activities with more, with more products and prizes for students to enjoy. Now the third goal is what I'm looking really forward to achieve through this opportunity, is that when I was listening to uh, pa speeches from past ASB members back in 2022 and 2021, I really thought myself, hey, maybe I can do that, and maybe I can stand as an ASB member and just help with what I'm pretty good at right now. And my, my third goal is to give just that motivation that I had to you. <laughs> and that third goal is, is to mainly to stress you that, that and motivate you that in the future, maybe you can stand up as an ASB member. Maybe you can speak up at what do you want to do to help others and, and st stand up as a representative for for righteousness, especially in God's words. So to wrap it all up, uh, I'm re looking really forward to to not only enhance in managing finances and of JCS and make, making AS, helping in planning ASB events with more goods to enjoy, but also to give give motivation that you can also later stand out, although, I, although maybe I wouldn't be elected as, an ace, as a treasurer for this time, but maybe you can for next time. So that's pretty much for my speech. My name is James Cho, and vote for me for your new, for new treasurer. And remember, no James, no money, and no motivation. Thank you. Good morning, students and teachers of JCS. I am Ida Choi, a junior student running for treasurer. Treasurer has the role of keeping track of the amount of funds or money gathered from the fundraiser and bazaars, and calculating the budget for each upcoming event, and making sure that the money from our JCS students are used wisely for each of the events that will be occurring. And there are four reasons that will support and persuade you JCS students to vote Ida Choi as your treasurer. First, I am experienced in having the job of treasurer. Second, I have skill to quickly count money and other materials. Third, I like to organize and manage the budget of events which requires number and calculations. Lastly, I have good skill in caring, communicating, and listening to others. 
So first, I am an experienced candidate for the role of treasurer. I had the role of treasurer for one year for a church praise team, and this was the time that we could get the title of treasurer, the one and only. And thankfully, I was selected to become a treasurer among other 10 candidates, and I had to calculate the budget for going field trips, example like lottery work, dining, and going to karaoke, and more. And after the events, I had to calculate the leftover money or budget that we could use for next time. Since I have the experience of organizing and calculating the budget and the amount of budget left, I would be able to calculate and organize the budget quickly with skills. Secondly, I have nice skill in counting money quickly. Starting from the first grade of elementary school, I have played with cards, example like Pokemon cards and other cards that you guys might know. And <coughs> I'm sorry. For the most of the time, I was just counting them when I was at home. And at school, me and my friends just battled with who has higher life range and stuff. And it was also just putting down cards and calculating how many cards we have. So I did that till middle school. Then from middle school I, and currently, I am playing solitaire, if you guys know. It is like an organizing card game, but I'm using poker cards. The first card game just related with my counting skills. However, this game requires me to count the cards, organize them in the same category from when they are mixed. Through the experience of counting cards for over nine years and organizing them for over three years, I will be able to count the funds from bazaars and fundraisers and organize them as quickly as possible. Third, I like to organize schedules and plans that require the role of money. Whenever I go hang out with my friends, the first thing I would use and do to do is calculate the budget. And after planning for somewhere to go, I will go into the site of the location and get data from them and calculate how much we need for the food, snacks, gifts, and also the entrance fee if needed. I take this as fun activity, which tells that I, which tells that when I work as an ASB member, I will be able to make others happy since I am working happily. Lastly, since other candidates are showing their math skills, I am in 11th grade honors in math too. This shows that I do have skills to do math. However, since in the role of treasurer, not a lot of concepts that I have learned are coming out, but I am very fast at calculating like addition and subtracting. So it tells me that I have capability to do math and calculation quickly. And in conclusion, I could utilize the experience of being the treasurer, quick, treasurer quickly counting cards and money, being happy while working as a treasurer and helping others. And the math and the math skills I could serve you JCS students more and support you guys to have a great experience during our ASB activities that are given from ASB while in the back organizing the budgets from fundraisers and bazaars and calculating the needed budget for the upcoming events. So for you guys' happiness to become true, please, please vote for Ida Choi as our treasurer. Thank you. Greetings, IJCS students, teachers, and staff members. This is Peter Kim speaking, our future vice president. I am back again as the candidate for vice president of our school, and I am extremely pleased to have the privilege to share my vision for how we can make our school even better. My goal as vice president is to create a better community and friendships between our peers and an environment where we can respect and understand our voice. Therefore, I believe collecting feedback and suggestions from JCS students uh, would accomplish the goal of making a better community and environment for our JCS. If I am elected as vice president, it would be my duty to be involved in the planning, organization, and impl implementation of school events and activities, such as fundraisers, spirit weeks, holidays, and other events. Furthermore, I'm willing to improve my leadership by helping JCS students as best as I can that was not made before by me. As I am an experienced leader, such as being treasurer for ASB, TA for the musical, and chair for the Greenpeace Club, I'm prepared to use my leadership skills actively with all the students. 
While you might be considering my one year of ASP lacks experience compared to others, having one year of experience has given me the advantage of having a better insight into our students' a perspective in wanting events and activities. Thus, I am prepared to recall the events and ideas that students desire. If I am elected as vice president, I will never forget the, the importance of a sense of unity in our school. I acknowledge the significance of creating lasting memories and making our school years unforgettable. Thus, I will be the vice president who will firmly stand as a peer who cares about our community and environment in our school to achieve many goals together. Although there might be difficulties and challenges during this academic year, I hope I can support and contribute to your hardships, efforts, goals, and cause as a vice president. Lastly, I am prepared to assist you and get comfortable with me. I believe that there exist three well-known Peters. Peter the Fisherman, Peter Parker the Spider-Man, and lastly, Peter Kim, who is willing to be the vice president this year. Like Peter, the fisherman, casting the net into the sea, I am prepared to cast my vision for a student body. Also, just like his faith has led him to overcome the challenges, I believe my faith would guide me as a prepared vice president who can overcome the challenges. Like Peter Parker, the Spider-Man, I would become your hero who is always waiting to save you from the villains that might cause you trouble. Similar to becoming a hero, being vice president is the next big step for me to build up my experience and improve my leadership. So I really hope that you will vote for Peter Kim because he guarantees that all of you will not be regretting but applauding. Peter Parker, the Spider-Man said, well, great, with great power comes great responsibility. I hope I will be able to use the great power as a great responsibility by serving you. Thank you. Good morning, JC students and teachers. I am Lois Lee from class 10. Today, I am really thrilled and excited to stand here again to share my experiences with you guys. For this 2023 to 2024 academic year, I am running for vice president. For the past two years, I have been in the Associated Student Body as PRM. I made posters, gave ideas, organized, and engaged with the students. Through all those experiences, I am ready and excited to spend the upcoming academic, academic years with you guys. I believe ASB has a role of being interactive with the students and teachers, being supportive while having leadership skills. Running for vice president is a big jump for me, which I am scared, but I am willing to be your new and accountable VP. A vice president is a moderator, supervisor, and an organizer. The role of vice president is to show and work behind the scenes to support the team and the president to make a vision. Being in the ASB for the past two years has taught me that it takes patience and time to plan out schedules and activities. Not only the importance of patience and time that I've learned, but I have also learned to handle my workload, improve problem-solving skills, and move on efficiently in times of difficulties. Through the experiences and practices, I would like to show you guys new ideas, but also be a great mentor and a friend of yours. The past ESV had a voice fishing box off and online. For the upcoming semesters, I would like to approach you guys with a new name and new ideas to hear your opinions and ideas. As you guys have experienced a lot of fun activities such as Search for the Cure, Secret Santa, Fundraiser, and more, this was all through your feedbacks and your voices. Your works and voices have shown throughout the semesters where the ASB was possible to help the people in the Philippines. I want you guys to again speak out and show your voices and ideas. Your choices and votes strongly matters, and I am looking forward on it. Your next VP, Lois Wee, will be always there to listen to you whenever you need me. Moreover, I believe the Vice President is responsible for being a bridge between students and the ASB. The Vice President maintains a schedule and works, sorry, works and has a role of overseeing. As a Vice President, I can be close with you guys and can make you guys feel comfortable, connected and joined. I will support you whenever you need me and my doors will be always open for you. As a more experienced candidate, I am willing to be your vice president for the upcoming year where I believe you are the key to the door. So I am just right in front of the door and remember you are the key. So vote Lois Lee as your next VP. Thank you. Hey guys, it's me, Caleb, and this year I am running for the ASB president. I first want to say thank you to all 
of our JCS students who will be voting for me and will be listening to this amazing speech. I'm sure that there are some new students and some of the younger students that don't know me as well as others. Um, I was the ASP secretary two years ago and the ASP treasurer the previous year. I'm also currently leading the basketball club in which I know our members are highly enjoying right now. Now, I believe that these experiences uh, contributed immensely to me as a leader. And so I am here running not as a secretary, not as a treasurer, not as a PRM, but as a president. This journey, which requires time, endurance, leadership, creativity, and dedication, is something that I heavily want to embark on. Through this experience, I wish to lead the ASB with not only leadership, but also with energy and happiness. I will accomplish this by sharing positivity towards all students and initiating interactions with other students to receive feedback or to just communicate. As many of you guys saw from my poster, I love playing basketball, the guitar, exercising, and even on the weekends, I sometimes enjoy playing some video games. Though my passion and yours may be different, I am just another student like you guys. I say this because it is important for a leader to treat students like friends. A student-to-student -student relationship is something that I highly value and something that I want to focus on. Sounds just like an ordinary student, right? I wish to be a friendly and bright president for the students and the ASB members. What I plan to create within JCS is a more energetic and loving community. I will guarantee not only excellence as a president, but hard work as for the student body as well. I believe not only I, but we can together make noticeable changes in JCS by putting in endless amounts of effort. I want to thank everyone for helping me be a part of this special journey. I'm looking forward to getting out there. Who will make the fun activities? It is I. Who will listen to your opinions? It is I. Who is the best president? It is I. Just do it and vote for Caleb Chang. Thank you. I see that a lot of you guys are getting tired from listening to all the speeches, but since this is almost the last one, please pay attention and listen. Let me start off with a story of a little boy. That boy was very young. And the thing about him was that he had no friends. And, but what the boy had was his imagination. He loved imagining and thinking about things in his life. And he played in his imagination. And he laughed in his, in his imagination. And he cried in his imagination. The imagination was to him a friend. But as he grew up, he began to realize that the world is much bigger than you thought it would be. And there were so many different people with so many different backgrounds, so many different personalities. And that overwhelmed him. And he became scared to talk to people, to approach people, and to get to know new people. But as he started thinking about his future life and tried to become a person and a leader he wanted to be, he started to realize, I need some friends. And to do that, he first, his first goal was to stop thinking too much, stop caring too much about what others think, and stop thinking about others. And thinking too much about others led him to go to a downward path and but after a long time passed with this struggle he came to realize or this question came to his mind can't I still be a good person a good leader with thinking about others and thinking about what people care about as you might have noticed by now this story of this boy is my story Yes, I had no friends when I was young. And I'm not good with approaching people, and I'm not good with talking in front of people. And honestly, my heart is pounding like crazy right now. 
And as you might have realized by now, this is not much of a speech, but more like a story. The reason I made this into a story is because I thought that would be the best way to express myself and to explain who I am. I'm not any candidate you might have thought or the president or the leader you would think. I'm not as diligent and I'm not the strong leader that you would imagine. But you might think that difference would make me a bad candidate for president. But I'm standing here today because I believe that I have what, it, what is most important for a leader. The ability to think of others, the ability to listen to their voices, and most importantly, the ability to be honest. This speech I give to you today is my honesty. I may not be a strong leader, but I hate more than anyone seeing people suffer because of what I do. And I love more than anyone seeing people being happy because of what I do. And my goal, if you vote me for president, is to make the members of the ASB happy and to make you happy. If you vote for me, I'll work hard to make fun, creative events for you guys. I'll be there for you to ask questions and I'll be there for you to talk and hang around with. I'll be there if you need me. I will not say I'll be the best president. I cannot promise you that. But I can guarantee you I can be a different one. And depending on your perspective, that difference would make me the best president. Vote Jason Kim for president, and I'll take you on journeys none of us would expect. So, to finish up, JCS, do you trust me? Thank you. Good morning, JCS students, teachers, and staff, and more. First, I want to thank all of you guys and the ASB candidates for your time and patience. Give a round of your applause to you guys for listening so well to everybody's speeches so far. All right. I am Priska Yu, a senior of two here at JCS, and this year I'm running for president. Now, what does being a president entail here at JCS? A president is a position of leadership within the ASB, as well as a collective student body. A president is a listening ear to the concerns and comments of fellow students. A president is a responder to all thoughts and suggestions from imaginative minds. A president is a cornerstone to the ambitions of ASB members' ideas. And a president is a servant to the students here at JCS. Having been a part of ASB for the past three years, first as treasurer and then as vice president twice after, it has taught me the different ways of being a leader. But my leadership positions are not limited to ASB. Having co-chaired and now chairing a student leadership club, the Agape Tree, as well as stepping up to different tutoring positions, these individual experiences have shaped me to become the leader that I am today. The responsibility, creativity, flexibility, and attentiveness that make a good leader did not come to me naturally. They were built into me over the years. I have learned to how to handle pressure, build cooperation, and even discipline myself. Being president comes with a truckload of responsibilities, and I am now confident that I can handle these responsibilities. Being president means sacrificing time and energy for the success and enjoyment of our students. Being president is one way that I can give back to the community that I have been a part of for the past four years. Through this year, I would like to build upon the success of previous events and activities, as well as introduce new ones to the growing collection of ASB traditions. Improving weekly fundraisers, as well as creating more extravagant events are all in store. Creating a platform for students to share their ideas is also in my itinerary. Easing the communication between ASB and the student body is always something that can be improved. And as a senior, this is my last year here at JCS, and one thing I would like to leave behind is strong leaders. The delicate balance between leading and letting others lead is a skill a president must perfect. If elected, I hope to build the strong leaders within the ASB to further serve you guys in the years to come. If you vote for me, not only will you be voting for an experienced and responsible student, but also someone who strives to do better and serve better. 
using my knowledge, expertise, and ambition in collaboration with your guys' wishes for the next academic year, I hope and look forward to becoming your president. I'm here to choose you. The question is, who will you choose? Vote Prisca U for president. Thank you.